My name is Brad Kailamas, and I'm a privacy policy analyst at the Center for Information Policy Leadership. Today, I'm going to be giving you five key CPL recommendations for blockchain from our discussion paper on digital assets and privacy. Firstly, CPL recommends that both regulators and industry implement a new innovative approach that fits with the characteristic and architecture of blockchain technology that is tech natural, functional, and outcome driven and addresses conflicts with increasing data transfer restrictions and data localization requirements. This is particularly important and necessary in the context of public and permissionless blockchain networks where data is not processed through control central means. The second recommendation is that all evolving policy and regulations must be industry driven and cross-regulatory, reflecting the nature of this new digital domain. Third, realistic and achievable goals must be the focus of stakeholders as they engage in dialogue with innovators, including taking into account users' experience. Fourth, existing enforcement measures must be reconsidered and likely will need to be tailored to be both effective and relevant to the blockchain environment. For instance, authorities must carefully consider the reality and practicalities concerning the applicable roles and responsibilities of different parties on blockchain and what their actual capabilities are. Finally, blockchain is all about innovation. In this frame, stakeholders must promote innovation to facilitate data portability and to achieve global interoperability among various distributor, distributed ledger solutions internationally. If you want to explore more of CIPL's recommendations for privacy protection in blockchain, you can access a free download of our paper on our website. Thank you.